Yo, what's going on guys? It's Cynical, and today for you guys, I've got a Jack and Daxter glitch. I kind of figured that because of the fact that we're going through all of the Jack and Daxter games at the moment. It'd be kind of cool to show you guys a few old school kind of glitches to do with a few of the games. So today, we're back on Jack and Daxter, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get Flop Flop out of the snowy mountains. So of course you guys will know that Flop Flop um, can only be controlled in a certain area of uh, Snowy Mountain. You can actually get him out of that area to explore the whole of Snowy Mountain and even a little section down in the volcanic crater. So what you guys want to do is you want to come to the area where you play as Flop Flop in Snowy Mountain. Now this trick can take a little bit of time to do but overall it's not too hard. You want to jump up onto this ledge and then you basically want to run and jump uh, kind of towards this little crevice part right here. And you want to double jump and then do the kind of, you know, the slam move, which is like X and square. And eventually you'll kind of um, phase through the rock and then you kind of want to quickly turn around to get back onto the solid surface. If you move too far forward, when you're actually phased through the rock, you'll end up falling through the ground and then you'll die and you'll have to respawn and do it again. It's it's not good, but it might take a couple of tries. As you guys can see right here, I ended up dying, which is fantastic. But then, of course, I just ended up doing it once again. So once you get Flop Flop through, then you're past the invisible barrier that you um, obviously can't go through, which stops Flop Flop from exiting the area. And then once you're through, you can pretty much explore the whole of the snowy mountain with Flop Flop. Of course, you guys should probably know that Flop Flop is a lot faster than Jack, he can jump a lot higher than Jack, so yeah, he's kind of useful for quite a lot of different things. Now, you might be asking yourselves, can you actually get him completely out of Snowy Mountain and into different areas? Well, you can actually get him into the Volcanic Crater if you use the gondola to go back down there. So, as you guys can see, I am near the gondola, I press circle, I make my way all the way down to the bottom of the gondola, and I'm now in Volcanic Crater. You guys will probably notice that Flop Flop has actually disappeared, and it appears that Jack is riding on like an invisible Flop Flop, which actually looks pretty damn hilarious. Um, that's kind of normal, that's what happens, it kind of glitches the model of Flop Flop out, and instead Jack would just be riding an invisible one. Um, now, you can't actually go into any other areas, because as you guys will notice, Right here, the game freezes. Um, I tried to get past the, the Sage's Hunt and the game actually ended up freezing, which kind of does suck. Um, and that really happens for whatever kind of way you go, the game will end up freezing. Another kind of interesting thing that I found out is if you jump into the lava with the invisible flop flut, you'll literally not die. Um, you'll lose all your health, but you'll keep kind of bouncing on the lava. So that's kind of another interesting thing I sort of found. But anyway, guys, this is a classic retro glitch that many, many people know about. So did you guys know about this glitch? Let me know in the comment section below. And until next time, guys, I'll catch you later. Peace. 